Hey, what's up coach? Welcome back to the channel. Now, uh, today's video, this is for coaches that get stuck in their business. They feel like, you know, every single year they're kind of doing around the same numbers and they can't break through that. And what I want to try to do today is explain why I feel like that's happening to most coaches. Now, here's the thing is most people now are so sucked into social media. Uh, for example, you might hear something that I say, and then like three minutes later, you go on Instagram and you hear someone talk about how you need to work your face off seven days a week until you die. Um, and then you might hear someone else, like you might see an ad pop up on this video where someone's talking about how you should only work like three hours per week and make 500 million dollars per year <laughs> right so there's all of this information now um, at your disposal and the big <clears throat> problem that i see with so many coaches is they <clears throat> like to learn they like to read books listen to podcasts watch videos go to events go to seminars hire business coaches um like people like to learn people like to invest themselves but really where you see any change with what you do is only when you implement right for example i had a video that i posted uh about two months ago about how to uh charge higher ticket sales right and normally when i post videos like that like I know that the information will absolutely help someone only if they do it, right? And I had a coach uh, that I did not know. He texted me after he saw that video. He was like, hey, um, awesome video. I wanna start doing this and can you help me? And I said, absolutely, go watch the application video on my website and apply for my program. And he was like, well, I don't have any money right now. And I was like, okay, well, just execute what was in the video. Because the video is going to show you how to do that. All right? And, you know, a day later, I had someone who watched the exact same video. All right? Who said, hey, I just closed my first $5,000 client over the phone. All right? This, this shows you. There's two different people. One who like watches something but does not follow through. The other person who just watches it like, all right, well, I'm just gonna go do this, right? And this is the problem with information overload, you do nothing, right? You're just listening to podcasts, you're, you're reading all these books and you're not executing. And the only way you can really grow your business is if you learn by doing, not learn by learning. Right, you you don't you, you don't advance anything in your business when you just read books or if you just listen to podcasts or you just watch videos. Even my videos, like my videos, are absolutely worthless, like uh, unless you actually just do something about it. Like, uh, and I tell people that all the time. Like, I have zero ego with this YouTube channel. I have probably one of the smallest YouTube uh, channels out there, based on how many videos we've published. Right, and I don't care about that. All right, my, my whole thing is I know if you implement uh, some of the stuff that we talk about, like a small fraction, you'll probably want to join my coaching program and invest money and, and get more help, right? And that, that program only works though if, if you are someone who can execute, right? So if you can't execute, uh, then ultimately you waste a lot of time taking in all sorts of information, all right. And I do believe that that's one of the biggest things that coaches who want to try to be like entrepreneurs, that that's something that they get bogged down with all the time, daily. They spend two, three, four hours watching stuff, listening to things. Like you could be using that time, like watching one video and then just go do it. Like go do what that video said and test it. Try it. See if it works. If it doesn't work, tweak it. Um, and that's the only way that ultimately 
you can grow what you do is by doing. And that's the only way to really learn. And, and I know a lot of people out there always tell me, well, Ben, like I, I study my butt off. I, I watch all this stuff. I do this. I do that. I went to this seminar. And I'm like, well, why aren't you growing your business? You, you know all this information, but you're not doing anything with it. All right. So, you know, the only reason why I'm creating this video right now is to talk about the problem, which is information overload and no one likes to execute. I don't want to say no one. Most people don't like to execute the information, right? And, uh, you know, that can be this, it's like it, it creates this fog between uh, coaches with where they're at right now and where they want to go. Like it's so foggy when they're driving because they, there's so much information, right? And they're like, oh, I'm going to go learn this or I'm going to go learn this or, oh, that sounds cool. I'm going to go learn this. And it has nothing to do with the business, right? And I think when you put your blinders on and you just execute the information that you're learning, then you stop spending hours and hours and hours every day trying to learn. You're just like focusing on, all right, well, how can I plug this into what I'm doing? Does that make sense for my business? Yes or no? If it doesn't, then I'm not going to do it. If it does, let's try it. Let's implement. All right. And uh, that's it for today's video. I hope this helps. I know most coaches who get distracted all the time did not watch this video because they're like, ah, I'm just going to go watch another video. <laughs> Right, so focus and discipline and having the blinders on to me the like I could take anyone who who has those traits and help them be very, very successful, like if they have their blinders on. If you don't have your blinders on in your business, then you just get so sidetracked. You get lost daily. Right. And uh that's it for today's video. I'll see you later.